Paso Safe is a volunteer-based organization that held its first ever safety fest today. KSBY News reporter Kimberly Cruz attended the event and tells us all about it. The community of Paso Robles gathered for the first ever safety fest in the downtown city park. People had the chance to learn more about safety and just about anything you can think of. Whether it's animal safety, bike safety, or just knowing what to do near a down power line, Paso Safety Fest had it covered. This is a really good example of how our community comes together and just really wants to promote how important it is to be safe. And that is the main reason why we're all here and making it fun. The emergency disaster and safety preparedness event included local experts who are trained to help when the unexpected strikes. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're mainly focusing on like the average person, what to do if somebody goes into cardiac arrest. But the idea behind this event was also to train and educate the local community. It's so important, especially for, for the kids, uh, to leave with the idea that they can actively participate in safety, right? And safety is everybody's responsibility, not just our first responders. Things happen, you know, we've had earthquakes and fires and all the kinds of craziness we have going on. Things happen and we need to remember what to do. I even decided to learn some things myself and gave this simulation a try where I practiced getting through a door if there was a residential or structure fire and no key available. Three. Oh. One, two, three. It was harder than it looked, but demonstrations like these were there to teach people skills to be safe. When the unexpected strikes, they are prepared. And just learn how to prepare yourself for a flood or an earthquake as well. You can help yourself, your family, your friends, your loved ones, your neighbor. It makes us all remember that we're all part of one big community and it brings us all back together. A community that makes Paso safe. And it's not a one and done event. Founders of Paso Safe say they hope to continue to do this event in the future and expand to nearby cities. In Paso Robles, Kimberly Cruz, KSBY News. The event was also a fundraiser with proceeds going toward the Paso Robles Downtown Main Street Association and the North County CERT program.